This week, we highlight another life well lived. At this very moment, brave doctors and nurses are sacrificing their own health in emergency rooms and intensive care units across the country to help patients with coronavirus. Some of them have given their lives. Caius Kelly spent the last several weeks treating coronavirus patients at Mount Sinai West Hospital in New York City, where he was a bright, well-liked nursing manager. With all hands on deck, Kelly was in the trenches helping his team of nurses care for the flood of new cases. On March 18th, Kelly tested positive for coronavirus himself and was placed on a ventilator in the ICU. He texted his sister Maria from his hospital bed saying he was okay and not to worry their parents with the news. Six days later, he died. Kelly grew up in Lansing, Michigan. He was the valedictorian of his high school class. He later moved to New York City to be a dancer before turning to nursing school. This week, Kelly's sister told us of her big brother. Caius brightened every room with his smile and his presence. When he left the room, there was something missing. You couldn't help but want him to come back. Caius Kelly one of the courageous healthcare professionals fighting a pandemic to save the rest of us, died on Tuesday in New York. He was just 48 years old.